at the end. Kai Kai, and we're gonna make you a really yummy, easy, on the go, overnight oats recipe. So overnight oats are so simple. You can add really beautiful fruits to this. We're gonna do that at the end. Um, but I wanna just show you how easy this is. So um, this is great for grab and go. As you know, I'm a mama to Leo and Kai, and it's hard sometimes to get nutritious breakfast in when you're in a rush. So this is great for like those early mornings when you're not prepared or when you can't just sit around and make a lovely breakfast. This is perfect. So the first thing you wanna do is grab half a cup of oats. So this is the way that our oats look. We just got this from Sprouts. They're just organic rolled oats. If you don't wanna use oats, you could use quinoa or buckwheat. Um, I really like the way that oats feel in my body, but obviously to each their own. Um, and then I'm gonna do a third a cup of, and I, the best thing to do in my opinion is to do a bunch of mason jars because then you can keep them in the fridge and you can do a bunch of them and then just seal them. So um, we already got this started. All we have in here is a half cup of oats, a third cup of almond milk, and you can use any almond milk. This is the one that we're using. It's just an unsweetened almond milk. And you could use coconut milk, you could use oat milk, you could use flax milk or any sort of, even soy milk, if that, that's okay for you. Um, I wouldn't use regular dairy milk, especially because there's so many great alternatives now. Um, after that, we are doing, this is obviously optional if you're a vegan, but I absolutely love this. We sell this whey protein on our, on our website. Love, love, love. Can't, Corey is behind the camera right now and she's <laughs> holding her heart because this is so <laughs> good. We love this. Um, it's digested really easily. It's grass fed. It's a great organic whey protein. And again, it's on the philosophy.com. So this is a great, because the superfoods from philosophy aren't sweetened, this is a great match. So I'll make a smoothie and do, you know, two scoops of green dream and cacao magic and then add whey to it. And it all just kind of balances out because this is sweetened with stevia. So anyway, we do one, we're doing a half a scoop that comes with a scoop or a half a scoop of the whey into the mason jar. And then we're doing two teaspoons of chia seeds. So let's grab a teaspoon. Wanna hold this? Teaspoon, let's grab a chia seed. So that's a teaspoon. So you're doing two of these. So grab some chia seeds. Nope, with this. Scoop it out. One, and jump it in here. And two. Perfect. So that's two teaspoons of chia what are you seeds. Put this into here? We are making, this is the same thing. This is the finished one that we already made ahead of time. And this is the one that we're going to make now, which will look like that tomorrow when we wake up. Um, okay. So then one teaspoon of Berry Bliss. Dun, 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 dun. You all know how much we love Berry Bliss. I created this protein powder. It's plant-based, raw, organic, vegan. What else is good about it? Gluten-free. It gives you lots of energy and it's really high in vitamin C. So this is great around times when anyone's getting sick around you and just to prevent in general not getting sick. So a nice, I'm going to do a heaping teaspoon of Berry Bliss. It has Camu Camu, highest vitamin C rich fruit on the planet. And then obviously 10 grams of protein from sprouted brown rice. Um, and then last but not least, we're going to do some cinnamon. So if you want to just do a bunch of sprinkles of this. It's about a teaspoon of cinnamon, depending on how much you like. And remember, cinnamon lowers blood sugar levels. So cinnamon is a great thing to add to just about anything, and it'll just keep you nice and even with your energy levels. Okay, that is it. And then we'll just mix it up, right, Alex? Yes. Okay, mix it up with a spoon. Put on the lid and shake it. Yeah, you can put the lid on and shake it, or you can have some, a helper mix it. <laughs> Make sure you keep it in, keep the spoon in, and then mix, mix, mix on inside the mason jar. And then just grab a top. Okay, nice work. I'm gonna mix it a little bit more. In one second. Make sure it's all mixed up. It already smells good, smell. Smell? It's already sweet. Okay. Go ahead, you can be released. <laughs> yeah. You just mix it up. You're just gonna pop it into the fridge and within a few hours it's ready, but it's, you know, it's called overnight oats. So it's the best to make like a bunch the night before and then for the week you're golden. Um, so then when you take it out, you just put it into a bowl or you can eat it out of the mason jar. That's another great thing. You can just grab a spoon, throw them both in your bag, 
you're good to go. Um, with this, I would definitely just add, if I were at home or had like the luxury of sitting down and eating my breakfast, I would put it into a nice bowl and throw some dried fruit, some fresh fruit, some superfoods on top, um, maybe drizzle it with a little bit of our honey. The Berry Bliss honey is really nice in this. Um, and as you know, all of our honeys are superfood honeys. So they've got the superfood powders inside the beautiful unfiltered organic honey. Um, and it's just really medicinal and beautiful. So yeah, and then just add this with fresh berries or whatever else you'd like and you are good to go. Um, anything else, Alex, about the overnight oats? Um, you can do cacao magic. Yes, instead of berry bliss, you could make these chocolate oats and use our cacao magic mix. Um, you could also make them green oats and kind of mix them if you want to get some greens in. So just know you can use any of our superfoods in this recipe instead of berry bliss or in addition to berry bliss. And that's it. I hope you enjoy. Leave a comment. Let us know what your favorite breakfast is and your favorite way to add philosophy superfoods into your breakfast. Mwah. Talk to you soon.